of the actual person here. Let's go ahead forward and talk and I think about this guy here. Let's show you some stuff here. He's been performing more and doing more of these branding deals because until they get... Let me come back. All right. Basically what you're seeing there is a hologram failure. That's a mask around this dude's face. Okay. That's, the, that's how the technology gets down. As you see, they'll see the light intensification on the tips of his fingers. Check it out. All you see is the tips of his fingers. See it? Look at all dripping on the nose right there. See that? See the light diffraction? Right here. You see the nose bleed away. Basically what we say is the picture in front of the actual nose itself of the entity is a, is a hologram, so you see the light break away, and you can see the energy around this guy. Check him out. Watch his hand. Look that. I'm doing more of these branding deals because until they get. This hand. There's again the light diffraction. There we go. Alright. See the light going? The light is going here. Right there in that section. In these two sections right here. You can see it almost looks like an x-ray. And that's exactly what it should look like with a holograph failure. Alright, here's a person's hand right there. Okay. What a difference. Let's go. For artists to make. AZ saying, hey, I'm going to try to bring out my own streaming service. So to be able to watch what they've been doing, I think is amazing. I think it's going to be a silver lining. And when you have labels that own them. There's some significance for you. Right there. There's the hand symbols for you right there. And what we're going to show you is this. This guy, the reason why they call him Pitbull, we shouldn't anyway, is because of this. Have you ever seen this guy's teeth? Not a dentist or anything, but... Mm, watch. On a piece of Vivo. So then that means you really can control this business at the end of the day. One way or another. The more you feed it, obviously, the bigger the evaluation. And watch this. He has a tooth inside of his mouth. On his right-hand side. Look at this tooth. Look at that. You see that tooth? He has eye teeth. I can see that. These, these are called eye teeth. Or that is it pushes out in front of the rest of it and he has a, a low uh, he has an underbite basically but I've never seen a tooth this large watch this I mean it's absolutely the size of two teeth really to be honest with you here's his hands again see the light diffraction right there you can see it right there see the little pinky Let's get you straight. Look at the hand. Look. See the see the bones, how weird they separate? Look. See it? It's just not normal, guys. Watch this though. I just think that they There we go. Well, take a look at this tooth. I mean this is why they should call him Pitbull. This tooth is, is ridiculous. Look at the size of this tooth. We'll get a better shot of it here soon. I know it's a way to get our music out globally. So it has globally? These very positive perks. Perks? This guy's a savvy businessman, and he's got some talent, and he's a hard-working bastard, man. Let me tell you something. This guy is constantly making money. He is a hero in the, in the Latino uh, music industry, man. He is an absolute hero. Unfortunately, he's part of the gang, and I'll show you why. He, I, I even caught him doing some Masonic handshakes.
do you have old deals that don't have that included? And so now you've got to rethink how, what are we going to do from here? Or have you taken a stand yet when it comes to? Oh, absolutely. absolutely. And especially the new deals coming up. That's a huge talking point. And either a deal maker or a deal breaker. Uh, let's get that. Let's get forward. Oh, absolutely. And Ready? Up next. Watch this. Okay, he shakes the hand of some dude. Alright, watch this. See the guy grab his hand like that? Now, somebody's putting their hands over the camera, look, to block it. The handshake. Well, watch this. This one they didn't block. Now, what that is, is what you're seeing. Their fingers, right here. Goes straight up, it's crossed, and this thumb comes down like that. That's a Mason ha handshake, guys. That's what that is. Masonic handshake. I don't care if this is going to be a multi billion dollar business, but I don't need a multi trillion dollar headache. And later, Pitt talks politics. You recently the brands approach you, mm -hmm. they want you to be the face of the brand. How do you ultimately decide who you're going to. Watch this. It's a community increasingly sought after by the largest corporations in the world. People in Espanol's Lena Hansen. It's growing and growing, and I think that's why more and more people are, you know, trying to get Latino customers. Stupid! Hey, should we spit on them? No, no, no! <laughs> Hold on. He's the perfect man. He has high respect. All right. Take a look at the back of his head. I'm not sure that's even usual. That has to be unusual looking, these bumps and shit. See the crown that goes around the top of his head right there? It's gonna be really weird shit. See it? Right there. That's really weird. See the protrusions there? Always wearing them glasses too, gang. Always. Especially when, when the lights are high. He's gotta have these glasses on, man. I'm telling you right now, this guy must be a draconian. His head looks like a, it's shaped like a Martian. Right here. Look at the top of it. So, right there, you can see it. See the protrusion right there, and the scales on it right there. All right, let's go further. You want to trust them? <laughs> Lots of brands approach you. Mm -hmm. They want you to be the face of the brand. How do you ultimately decide who you're going to get behind and who you're not going to get behind? Time is for us couldn't be better. You're talking about at a time where our culture being. You know, this is a good one. So. As well as the world's largest company, company. Cuba. Mm -hmm. Wake up and live it. Make it your. Sorry, but it's not. You get to a section here where his, he opens and I'm going to show you his teeth again. In the movie Scarface, when Tony's talking to Manolo. And he looks at Manolo, I want what's coming to me. Me, I want what's coming to me. And Manolo goes, oh, well, what's coming to you? The world, Chico. The world. the world, Chico. That's right, Chico, the world. He's going to get the world because he's working with the right people. There's that tooth I was talking about. That is the largest tooth, eye tooth, I guess, if you want to call it that. I don't think I've ever seen anything like that. Have you? Have you guys seen anything like that? That tooth? Check out his teeth. He has a few extra teeth there, looks like. See it? That's a weird looking thing right there, dude. Look at that. That's crazy. I think these eye teeth are sticking out of his, his real teeth. <laughs> oh, man. Look at that. That's just unbelievable. I'm just amazed by that, really, to be honest with you. There's the hand signals again. Play it out. God knows. That's just. But you know what we don't clone, stop it looks like stop working. right next to him and shit. I love the work, love the hustle. See if we can find it. This looks like a real clone, right, that he's pointing to at his show. Watch, check it out. It's supposed to be a wax figure or something, I guess. And there's the... You see it? He just threw up the uh, devil horns. There you get a better shot of him. Further away from the camera, there it is. Check it out. Yeah, it doesn't even... It 
His eyes are really weird. I mean, years from now, to be able to say, hey, my great 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 grandfather built this on music. Let's go ahead a little bit. There it is. Really weird. Check it out. Check this thing out. That's the, that's the signature right now. That's the thing. Look at that. How real does that look? That's supposed to be some kind of synthetic person. That looks like a real person. Looks like one of his doubles. Look. I mean, look how close that is to him. Wow. Let's see what he has to say about it. The red nose. <laughs> He's definitely better looking. Definitely better looking, and he's, he's a little more serious, let me tell you. Huh? He looks like a synthetic uh, pit bull. Check it out. There's pit bull. There's synthetic pit bull. Check that out. It's weird. We'll break it out right there, guys. This is Chris Archer here for Destruction by Design. I'm just showing you some anomalies with pit bull. Guy's very hard worker, very talented, and very business savvy and smart. For destruction by design, this is Chris Archer. Have a good day. A little bit of late intensification. You see, and you see the energy on the outside of the of the actual person here. Let's go ahead forward and talk and I think about this guy here. Let's show you some stuff here. He's been performing more and doing more of these branding deals because until they get. Let me come back. All right. Basically, what you're seeing there is a hologram failure. That's a mask around this dude's face. Okay, that's, the, that's how the technology gets down. As you see, they'll see the light intensification on the tips of his fingers. Check it out. All you see is the tips of his fingers. See it? Look at all dripping on the nose right there. See that? See the light diffraction right here. See the nose bleed away. Basically, what we say is the picture in front of the actual nose itself of the entity is a, is a holograph. So you see the light break away, and you can see the energy around this guy. Check him out. Watch his hand. Go back. doing more of these branding deals because until they get I watch this hand. There's again the light diffraction.